One of the challenging things about uh, doing modding for Daisy or any other project is how do you monetize your work? How can you get paid for what you do? Um, and so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to monetize GitHub. Um, and I'm a big believer that you should give people every opportunity to be able to give you some cash if they wish to do so. You should make it incredibly easy for them. It shouldn't be, they shouldn't be scratching your heads thinking, oh, I want to drop this guy five bucks so he can get himself a beer or, or a posh coffee. Um, how do I do that? It should always be obvious. Um, now, obviously, GitHub isn't the only method that you're going to use to 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 uh, to do this but this that's what this video is all about so let me show you what i'm talking about because if you do mod for daisy whether that be xml modding json modding or um, steam workshop modding you may well use github to store some files or you might well use it often as a as a wiki so let's have a look at my github so here's my github here and as you can see on the main page if you scroll down there's a sponsor button there and if uh, people click through to that sponsor button, they can opportunity to give me like a one-time amount um, donation, or they can become a um, monthly sponsor of a particular amount that they want to do. Um, if you go into a particular GitHub repository and you scroll down, you'll see this bit that says sponsor this project. And we have a link to the GitHub sponsorship project. And we've also got a link to Patreon and we've got a link to PayPal as well. So people can go over to um, my um, Patreon and become a member over there. Or if they just want to drop me um, some cash on uh, on uh, PayPal, they can. So I've made it pretty easy for them to be able to do that. Um, so how do you do this? Well, it's all over on GitHub. And what I will do is I'll put some links in the description below this video with all the instructions because if you're using github already it's 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 pretty easy to do you just follow it uh, follow it all the way through the way that i recommend you do it though is that set up um obviously set up your sponsorship um uh, with the github sponsorship program uh, it's not available in every single country but it's available in most countries um, and that takes you to the github sponsors website you can go through and you can put all your details in there and then what you want to do is uh, click on this link which is displaying a sponsor button in your repository um, and that what that does what that does is it ma makes you create a funding file with uh, the particular um, format that you need for one repository um, and the reason why you want to do that is once you've done that um, and you've checked that it works you can then create a default uh, funding a file which will display the sponsorship button on every single repository you've already created but the problem is that the format for the file isn't completely obvious so when you go down and you scroll through here down to the bottom here we go and this bit here which tells you what the format is it's not always you're like oh, what does that mean so if I quickly show you mine let's see if we can go into it uh, update funding .ymi. so what you end up with is it should look like that so for github it should say just have your username for patreon you should just have your username like that and then for uh, paypal it should be just be your paypal.me.url which you can get from your paypal account so so that's the format like that for github and then you can you when you go into the file you see there's lots of different other formats but they're the most common ones um, and then once you've done it you, you can say preview changes and you pre can preview it and then you can just double check that it actually works because if it doesn't work all you'll see on your github repositories on the right hand side let's go to one uh, let's go here uh, where were we let's go to this one what you'll see is when they scroll down they'll see sponsor this project and there'll be nothing underneath it and if you get that it means that you formatted the uh, the finance file incorrectly when it's formatted correctly it will pop up and it will give you all the details there so there we go so that's basically it really um, I'll put all the links in the description below this video and you just go through on how to set up uh, github sponsors um, how to join the github sponsor program how to display a sponsor button on your repository 
um, and how to create a default community health file they call it and then the one you're interested in is the uh, I think it's the .yml file the funding .yml file but again I won't go through it in detail here <coughs> excuse me step by step because I've got a bit of a cough but also that if you just go through it line by line and follow the instructions on github that's probably better off than me doing it but that will then give you the opportunity to monetize uh, github to give people the opportunity to throw you some cash your way should they find your work helpful anyway that's enough from me hopefully you found this video helpful <laughs> if you have hit like if you want to see more the same press subscribe and of course i'll see you again soon